Good morning, collective. We're going to do a quick energy check, see what your ancestors, the universe, the divine want you guys to know as you're navigating through your journey, ascending to your highest good. I've already called in the appropriate protection. This is a time. This reading is whenever it finds you. We're going to jump right into this. Ancestors of the highest way light, only of the highest way light, nothing other but the highest way light. I ask that you help me provide clear messages for the collective as they're navigating through their journey and ascending to their highest good. Please and thank you. Open to abundance, number eight. Believe you deserve, accept plenty and prosperity. A lot of you guys may be seeing sunflowers, birds are just flying close by you. Unexpected money. I'm getting somebody's about to go through some get some unexpected money open to abundance number eight believe you deserve it and accept the plenty believe it it's all about the mind collective and I, and that's one of the things I had to learn was how to switch my way of thinking you have to believe it you have to feel that you already have it even if you have like Let's say you have like $50 in your account and there's something you want to get. <clears throat> you have to believe as soon as you spend it, that that money's flowing right back to you in different ways. You have to believe it. And that's one of the things I have to learn how to do. I can never make this up. Creative solutions. I can never make this up to you, collective. Think outside the box. View things from a higher perspective. Some of you guys have squirrels coming up to you. Coconuts I'm seeing. Some of you guys are carving something. You're carving something. Be creative like this squirrel. The squirrel never leaves their acorn. They find a way to get that acorn and bury it wherever they need to bury it. You guys, I'm sick. <clears throat> there's butterfly, there's transformation here. Somebody's carving something. I'm seeing a white picket fence. You have to think outside of the old way of thinking. When look at it, it looks like he's saving up, stacking all that money. But there's something the squirrel needs. And the squirrel's like, if I spend it, I'm gonna be left a little bit left. It was like, look at this big acorn that's about to drop in here. Stop thinking like that. It's got to be equal flow, equal give and take. Believe your ancestors got your back. Believe that they, that money's going to come in. Message Spirit said, Don't shuffle, turn that card around. Listen to the message, pay attention to that message. The message that somebody needs to think outside of the way that they were thinking. That's not, I don't know how to explain it. That was something that was really hard for me, collective, and I get it because it's been like <clears throat> when I started learning how to manifest. I used to hold on to the last little $20 that I had. If it was my last little 20, and I needed to get me, like, <clears throat> sage, <clears throat> guys, I'm sick. <clears throat> I needed to get me sage. I needed to get me candles, you know. <clears throat> Stop doubting yourself. Stop doubting yourself, Spirit said. Stop doubting not only yourself, stop doubting your ancestors, I'm hearing. Stop doubting yourself. Um, I used to sit there and be like, oh my God, I only have $20, you know. But I used to spend it. And as soon as I would spend it, I would say it in my mind, my ancestors got my back. Are you ready? Are you ready? 
surprise gift visit information is coming in you gotta believe it believe in the magic believe <laughs> Leo deeper understanding God sees and hears everything. God knows what you need. God knows your heart. Your ancestors know. They know what you need. They need you to start believing in them. Stop doubting yourself. Non-believers will believe. I can never make this up. I can never make this up. In the beginning, I used to be like, I'm not spending my last 20, you know... I would need this. I would need that. And I used to be scared to spend it because it was my last 20. But that was the old way of thinking, right? Hold on to your last 20. Why? Trust. Trust. Go with the flow. What did I just say? As soon as you're spending it out, believe that that money is going to flow right back to you. As above, so below. As above, so below. I keep getting that eight. The infinite sign. Accept. Relax and trust. Relax and trust. Relax and trust. Go with the flow. The law of grace. What did I just say? I keep getting that eight. What did I just say? Trust your ancestors. Start saying it. Start thinking those things. Start believing. Creative solutions. Think outside the box. Be open to receive it. When you're being open, you have to be open to let go too. Let it out. Give it, give it back. It has to be an equal give and take. God knows what you need. The divine sees everything. They know what you need. Your ancestors are never going to leave you fucked. They're never going to leave you fucked. They need you to start believing. You might have some envious people around you that are envying. Some of you guys might be already in this energy. And you got some envious motherfuckers around you getting mad that they see you not having to do so much work. But you got... This abundance flowing into you in all different avenues. I created a post yesterday. Non-believers are going to believe. These envious motherfuckers are going to start believing. I created a post on my community um, thing yesterday. Yang, yang, yang. And it was talking about moving in silence. You got haters. Move in silence. Some of you, the man holding the coin, that's the king of pentacles. Some of you guys are about to get into that energy. If you guys were experiencing financial constraints, Spirit said, not no more. Be open to receive. Be open to receive. Not no more. Your Ah! Spirit said, yeah, look, victory. Ancestors of the highest white light. Only of the highest white light. Nothing other but the highest white light. The rainbow's about to shine right to you. I'm hearing. You're, you're about to be at the pot of gold. I'm hearing. You're going to be able to help your community. Door to spirit. Pay attention to spirit. Trust them. I was so scared, guys. I'm not lying to you. When I first when I first started this manifestation, getting your strength. Believe. Believe. 
when I first started manifesting and learning about all of this stuff, I used to be scared to spend money my last little bit. Then I had to learn how to stop being scared and trusting my ancestors. And once I did that, once I released that, that doubt, that fear of trying to control the little bit I had, this, it, it just started flowing. <laughs> I can never make this up. The law of grace. financial constraints, these envious people, these non-believers, these envious people, non-believers, they're going to start seeing. Spirit's about to make sure that these people see. Spirit's using, some, somebody, somebody here, Spirit needs to let you know that you're going to be the vessel that's going to help other people. to show other people the ancients the light spirit's gonna use you to show other people so other people can have a deeper understanding God knows what they're doing using you as an example is going to help a lot of people those non-believers. What else, ancestors? People are going to be sitting here. How did you do this? Get ready. You're about to rise. Spirit is about to make an example out of you so that other people can see. I'm hearing that there's certain people in your community. Yeah, no more carrying burdens. Those burdens are about to be lifted. There's certain people in your community that need to be awakened, and you're going to be the one to help awaken them. They're going to come to you for guidance. Some of these people are lost. They're having a hard time going through their awakening. Yeah. They're having a hard time. Sure you guys are hitting that subscribe button, clicking the all bells button, and giving the video a thumbs up. Show us the cards we need to see. Please and thank you, ancestors of the highest way, right? Show us the cards we need to see. Power of over difficulty. Reclaiming your reclaim your motherfucking power spirit. Power. It's all about the mind. We program the way your mind is, is processing things. 
It's all about mental breaking those difficult barriers that we've been programmed through, reclaiming that power, building your own fucking legacy, your own world spirit set. Believe it. Networking. Some of you guys are about that. What did I just say? Y'all about to network. Some of these people from your community that didn't believe are going to be firm believers now, Spirit said, because you're about to fucking rise. You're about to rise. There's, they're about to see a rebirth of you. They're about to see a rebirth of who the hell you are. Achievement. Achievement. A step back because spirit is about to put you in all glory spirit said take a step back because they're about to put you in glory break that barrier of your mind trustworthy guidance from your ancestors your spirit guides listen to what they're saying Somebody's getting a message here. You're about to start a new beginning, Spirit is saying. This is really about to be a new beginning for somebody here. You have no idea what your ancestors... And it could be so simple. It could be as simple as... You guys are just sitting there, going through shit. Everybody turning their back on you. You can't even borrow money from people. People are not there helping you. People used to... People that you used to call on, that used to call you for help and guidance, are now looking down on you. Spirit knows what they're doing. <laughs> ooh, ooh, Spirit seen everything. Bird's eye, clear view. And these people seeing you going through wounded who. These people seeing you going through bullshit. These people seeing you being going through all these difficulties and not one person helping you the fuck out when you was always there to help every fucking body out. That's how crazy spirit will work it. Spirit said, get ready. Because you're about to bore. You're about to roar. Some of you guys cried out to your ancestors. They heard you. They heard you through this turbulence. They heard you. They heard you. These people are going to be coming back saying, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Wait. I'm sorry. Get ready, Spirit said. Stay humble during this process. Stay humbled. Yeah. Trust the timing. Some of you guys are. Spirit said, trust where you guys are going to be led. Some of you guys, it may be as simple as Spirit just, you just get a thought in your head to go play the lottery. Trust where you're being guided towards. Trust those nudges, those intuitive messages you're getting from your ancestors. Trust it. Trust the timing. Trust it. Trust the timing. They're going to tell you what you need to do. It could be, and I'm not saying that go play lottery, guys. Okay? It could be as simple as that. <clears throat> Think big picture. Start thinking bigger picture. Open your, your mind. Open to abundance. Think big.
surrender to the divine change. This is for the best. Surrender to divine change. This is for the best, Spirit said. You're going to achieve this. You're going to achieve this. You're going to ram right through this. Somebody's going to get the message loud and clear to see the bigger picture loud and clear. It is going to guide you what to do. Yeah, there's going to be a recovery. If you guys have been feeling financial constraints, Spirit said, get ready because you're about to recover. You're about to rise. Yes, this is about to help you start a new beginning. Victory. Hi, gangster. One more, I said this, one more. It's not the right time. Some of you guys are like, should I go pay the lottery? Spirit says, it's not the right time. <laughs> no, don't do that. not the right time to try to get that abundance right now let spirit give you the message on when the time is right trust the timing trust it trust it don't make it don't make this be your timing when oh i gotta go play the lottery now no spirit said stop not the right time no there's going to be a recovery, but trust the timing. Trust it. Your abundance, This somebody's about to be fucking, look it, abundance came out twice in two different decks. The man holding the coin, that's abundance. Victory. Some of you guys are going to be seeing angel numbers. Spirit's going to show you. There's going to be synchronicity. Spirit's going to show you on your on your path. So some of these people are going to want to reconcile with you. Maybe it could be this man holding this coin trying to come back to you. Boundaries with this person. That's what I have for you, collective. Love and light.